Well, the atmosphere has been building up all day long, and we're almost ready for kickoff here at Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Chelsea taking on Manchester United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. It should be a match to look forward to. Chelsea get it underway. Effective looking pass. Gallagher. Nkunku. Determined defending. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. And Chelsea win the corner. Well, they fancy a short one. And whipped into the box. And problem solved for now. And continues his run. A good and fair challenge. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular. What do you expect to see from him? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. Well, the fans are begging for a shot. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been the keeper well they should be ahead now yes it was a good save Derek but he should score from there and short it is good looking cross and Kunku and a body in the way breaking at pace Shaw and slipped through beautifully well deemed to be offside by the merest of margins well it's very close to being the perfectly timed run but whether it's an inch or a yard he's still offside Enzo Fernandez nicely timed tackle Vlahovic
Mount. Enzo Fernandez. Teammates available. Oh, good strike! And fine goalkeeping. Dusan Vlahovic. Well read to win possession back. Excellent ball over the top. Well, those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. Yes, a stalemate so far. Will that situation change? Fernandes, using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Intense pressure. And it's gone over the line. Vlahovic. Eriksson. Vlahovic. Surely. And the keeper more than equal to it. Who can he pick out? Mount. And Havertz. And we will have just one additional minute. Targets available. Cross comes in. And the keeper got there. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Trying to deliver it accurately. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. Well, he's got a few things right in this first half, but not everything. Yes, there's certainly room for improvement. He struggled to have any real impact on the game. He hasn't gotten the ball enough and when he... So back underway here into the second half. Bruno Fernandes. Now with Rashford. Ericsson. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. He's in with a chance. Oh, he squandered the chance. And he was clean through as well. Ericsson Anthony the running room in the wide position oh surely and it's in 1-0 they breached the defence Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the strike from Fernandez is absolutely perfect. Pace, power and accuracy. What a player he is. And away they go again. What effect will that goal have on Chelsea? We're going to find out. Fernandez. Now 
Vlahovic. Read it superbly to take back possession. Kai Havertz. Promising looking attack. Now sliding in field. Well, it didn't really go according to the script, did it? Well, the less said about that, the better, because that's a really poor attempt in the end. So a personnel change then. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Dusan Vlahovic. Casemiro. Spot on with that tackle. Well, it's going to be a great finish here. These Chelsea fans are ramping up the noise now. They're surely going to get another chance before the end. And teammates to play it to. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Fifteen minutes left for play. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Not to be this time. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly read. Marcus Rashford. He continues his run. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. And that's not going to worry the keeper. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. And they will make the change now. It's a short one. Kai Havertz. Free kick to Chelsea. Here's a change for Manchester United. accurately towards the far post and it was a menacing attack but tidied up an awful lot of green space to run into strong play here fed over towards the back post and Chelsea get the decision from the referee and in the event just a talking to but could easily have seen yellow and deep into the penalty area. Oh, terrific save. Well, that's surely it. That was possibly their last chance. What a great save that was. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Chance to equalise here. And the spot kick is converted as calmly as you like. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Well, here it is again. And it can be a risky penalty. But he hits it straight down the middle. The goalkeeper goes one way. The ball goes through the middle. Excellent finish.
So the ball is rolling again at one all. Sterling and Havertz. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes here.